Hello everybody, this is A Stocky here and welcome back to pretty sure this is gonna be like episode six of my let's play of Daisy single player. Just having a quick look around. Now what I'm gonna do right now is I'm going to save the game. Save. Ah, oh, okay, so you gotta override a save. There we go. I will just override the old save. Uh, part of the reason that I'm doing that is I have just updated uh, to the latest beta. And I have heard from some people that sometimes uh, changing the beta version that you're on will cause some issues. I'm hoping that's not the case, but that could very well be the case. Now, as at the end of the last episode, we are in, or at least we are at, Electro. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to run around a little bit and try and work my way um, around I'm going to try and work, like I said, work my way around and see if I can't get around a little bit closer to the hospital and to where the supermarket is because I think I think they're both over that way because I don't really want to just uh, end up entering in and kind of having to run through town. I want to just like duck in, get what I need, duck back out. Now, I was looking at a bit of a video. I was looking at a bit of a video recently that talked about um, the ways you can improve your frame rate and the way you can I guess make things run a bit faster and one of the ways that they suggested was turning off the post-processing effect um, it's also been indicated to me that that probably makes everything look a lot sharper in the distance and thereby makes the game a little bit easier to play now I had a thought about that and thought you know what, I don't, I don't really want it to be like that. I mean, the post-processing blur effects and things they're adding, they definitely make it more difficult to see things at long distance. But, but I think they're meant to be there. Now, the other thing I was considering is that crosshair that I have in uh, first-person view when I'm not looking down the sights. Because this is single-player, I have the option to turn that off if I so choose. And I'm not totally sure about that idea either. Um, I've already turned off the additional map information. Uh, crap it. Zombie. And I have already turned off... Um, what is it? The ability to like mark waypoints on the map and then have them show up on the heads-up display. Nope, that didn't work. I had read somewhere that if you hide in the center of a tree, zombies can't get you. Uh, clearly that's not the case. Okay. Run over this way a bit. Where'd he go? I'm sure he was following me. Definitely got the crazy pant thing going on though. There he is, he must have got stuck in the trees when I ran back out through it. Right, well, while I'm out here anyway, I've gone a bit too far now. Certainly further than I intended to go. Yeah, that's definitely not an accessible building. So you can see the way that, that blurring kind of effect disappears after a little while of staring at the same spot, zoomed in. And that's I guess to simulate that your eyes are kind of focusing and adjusting. What I might do is I might try turning off that music and see if that background zombie sound disappears. Cannot fire.
not completely convinced it's going to make a difference. Now, what do I have that I can eat? Um, blood bags, camping tents, a can of unknown food. That's got to be good, doesn't it? Hope it tells me. Nope, doesn't tell me what it is after I've eaten it. Ah, never mind. I did that for two reasons. Stuck in a tree. Yeah, I did that for two reasons. The first is that I wanted to be able to um, know that I have enough blood that I can see colour. And the second was to just uh, get my food bar restored. I probably should before I head into town. See, if there was a sniper up in that building, I'd be in a lot of trouble right now. But there's not. So what I'm going to do is just move around the side here. And this is something I would not suggest doing if you're playing multiplayer. Because I'm kind of running through an open field where there's a good target line behind me. And there's a good target line up there as well where they could shoot me. But... Uh, the idea of running up to those bushes and then sort of snaking and tagging all the way around and all the way up there to get up to here to come back down uh, doesn't really appeal to me in single player right now. The... The... Are you crouched? Yes, you were. Get back down then. So yeah, the, the idea of having to do that is just not a lot of fun. There's the... Now, should be... Over there is the supermarket. Yeah, that looks like the back of the supermarket. And the hospital should be somewhere in that same area. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to duck back through the bushes here. Hopefully get where I'm going. I'm not sure how long this episode is going to go for. Because I totally forgot to start recording. I mean, not recording. Um, I totally forgot to start timing how long I was recording for. That most certainly sounded like gunshots. I think they came from over this way. Well, no sense sitting still, just in case they do know where I am. It is equally possible, though, that they have no idea where I am, and they're trying to use some gunshots to flush me out. At least, that's what you could be doing if you're a player. The other thing that... Not the Jamie Heineman zombie. Yes, the Jamie Heineman zombie is chasing me again. Don't stop moving. Don't stop moving. Definitely gunshots to the left there. I'm afraid if they hit me I'm going to die, so I'm not going to stop. Get some trees in between us. Vault that fence. Ah, oh, man, more gunshots. This is not cool. Okay, get inside. Holy crap, that's a lot of gunshots. Like, seriously, holy crap. And they're still going. <laughs> I 
Some, oh, they're still going again. Someone who definitely has way more ammo than me is going absolutely nuts right now. An assault pack. It's an empty assault pack. Hmm. I don't know if an assault pack, I think what I have, which is like the British assault pack, I think is better. So many gunshots. We got more painkillers, okay. Actually, what was that? What kind of ammunition was that? Oh, it's a watch. Excellent. Man, that gunshot, those gunfires are coming from so close now. What have we got here? Bandage. We always have more bandages. Another soda can. drink that one. We'll take the next one. Now I'm here mainly to look for food. Way more painkillers. Like I said, here to look for food. Let's see what we got here. What do we got here? What do we got here? Another watch. Okay. The watch spawns are a little off, I think. Ah, uh, take map. Awesome! This has just got beyond ridiculous now. That is definitely two guys with different weapons shooting. That sounds to me, and I'm only guessing, that sounds to me like some kind of 5.56 five, ammo. Anything in here? No. So we found a bunch of different assault packs. Wow. Tell you what, to say I am pinned down inside the shops, I think is an understatement the amount of shooting that's going on. Cans of beans, okay, awesome. Let's hit the deck. Okay, we want to go open the bag. Okay, that did not sound good. That sounded like a bullet that came close. There's more food over there, though. Damn this game. What do we got? God, I can hear too much shooting going on. I'm so nervous now. Zombies everywhere. This is not the place to be doing this. This is not the place to be doing this.
saving game just in case I do something dumb. <laughs> the tension. Okay, backpack. Gotta open my backpack. Um. Okay, looks like my backpack's full. God, all the shooting. Um, okay, let's open backpack. Let's do a swap over. Let's eat some beans. What do we got there? Looks like another can of beans as well. Take their can of muffins. I now have to get the heck out of here. This is just too much. Probably in about the safest spot I can be at the moment. I'm using the extra cheaty third person view. tension. Well, that is a nice tense point, I think. I'm going to check how long the video is, and I'm going to see about coming back and doing another episode. Um, thanks very much for watching, guys. A-Stocky out.